I'm making this video in the dark because it's three in the morning and I had an enormous insight and I want to just record it even if there's just no video. I was thinking about people in my life that feel like they're not understanding something and they're not moving forward in their energy. And then I heard life tell me, there's an even deeper level for you, Kyle. It said every single fear must be transcended. Every fear that you have on this planet, whether it's the whole world never understanding you, whether it's being abandoned, whether it's being unloved, whether it's being all alone, whether it's dying, every fear you have, Kyle, is an illusion in your body and it must be transcended. No matter what it is, there are some fears that we trick ourselves and say that fear is real. But it's actually not. Once you understand deeper and deeper what you truly are, you'll still realize the fears are an illusion. You transcend the fears by not having to experience them fully. But by being present and experiencing them internally. Because they're still all illusions that are lodged in the body. And the body's been trying to purge it. It tries to purge it by seeing it through dreams. What we call a nightmare is actually a complete gift. It's your body trying to purge something that's stuck inside all of your fear are dark things that are stuck inside you. They're not things that are stuck outside of you, they're stuck inside of you. There's nothing you could come up with that you are scared of happening that doesn't exist inside of you, which means it's an illusion. And if you get more and more and more present and become more and more and more than now, you will understand that your fear is actually a pointer to a false self. The story of a separate self is what dies once you transcend the fear. You transcend the fear by becoming present and letting anything that you're scared of happening happen inside of you. And you do that by surrendering to the outside and saying, I allow that thing I'm scared of to happen because it exists inside my body. What you're transcending is an illusion. If you don't transcend it inside, it very well could happen on the outside. The illusion of the separate self must be transcended to get you connected to the truth of what you are. That's awakening. That's the truth. The illusion of one in eight billion, the illusion of the separate self, that you're a small separate self and all the other people aren't you. The 
this whole thing is a dream. Your job is to be present. Get here and let any fear that's inside your body be realized. The more you allow it, the more you cry it out, the more it leaves. If you understand this fully, you'll realize you're fully safe, always. Because the ego is scared that it's going to be abandoned by itself or hurt by itself, the other person that can hurt the ego is also you. The physical body isn't you either. You can transcend your fear of death by allowing the inner death to just happen. Not actually cause yourself to have physical death, but letting the story of the small eye die. Become present for your nerves, become present for your feelings. There isn't a fear that isn't a lie. You're all that is. Surrender and let. Let God take over.